Pete's Montana you're gonna hear again. We're gonna do a peak valve seat uh, change to the valve of the air cylinder. So here we have a air valve which is uh, disassembled already and on the inside you can see that there is a, a small uh, seal. So we're gonna take that off and uh, install a new custom valve seat. Okay, for the actual taking the valve seat off, what we'll need to do is uh, we'll need to have a, some kind of a short and thin tool. I'm using an Allen key, one and a half millimeter, and the idea is to push the valve seat off without making the insides on here so be careful while you're doing it so you don't damage it and work it on the corners like on four corners little by little so you don't damage the actual o-ring that's on the valve seat so let's get cracking and i'll show when it drops off Alrighty, so I finally got it uh, pushed out, so I'm gonna show you guys how it looks. So I'm just gonna take the valve and there it is. So already spinned a little and here you can see that there is an o-ring. Be careful not to mess it up. And this is the side where the valve pin is seating, so you can see the small indents on there so yeah let's get a custom part out which i have here and then one there so i got a friend to do the valve seat he marked it already so let's put this on here okay so there you can see that he marked the uh side that goes to the muzzle end and uh, we're just gonna take the o-ring here and give a little bit of lube on it we're gonna clean the insides on here and we're gonna lube it with uh, q-tips and then we're just gonna install it here with uh, most probably a long socket so we don't mess up the uh, angle on the uh, in inner diameter so we can get the uh, valve pin seating properly. Let's get cracking. So yeah, remember the clean up on the, the inside, the valve seat. So here you can see it's quite a lot quite a lot of dirt there so just get that all nice and cleaned and then Vaseline it. Okay so now we got the uh, valve seat seal or ring finally taken off it's in good condition now we'll just loop it up and put it on the new new peak valve seat and that'll be it okay so now hopefully you can see there is a little mark there maybe you, you can see but i'll take a picture so there's the mark there now it's installed properly there the right way and we can continue the assembly Okay, so when that part is done, we got the, uh, let's put some light on, we got the valve pin there, and now we're gonna hammer the valve pin into the seat a little bit, so it'll seat better with this kind of one, so we'll just drop it there, give it a couple of hammers, and should be good to go.
Okay. We got the air cylinder pressurized now. And let's see that it keeps its air. <laughs> 